Hi everyone, new topic, Solvase process. It is the process of manufacturing sodium carbonate, sodium carbonate or soda ash. The another name is soda ash. So this process is devised by a Belgian chemist. His name is Ernest Solvay. His full name is Ernest Gaston Joseph Solvay. In 1864, he devised this process. So this process is widely used method for the production of sodium carbonate. It is more economic and less polluting method than Leblanc method. See the Leblanc method means it is the old method for the production of sodium carbonate. So now widely used method is Solvay process. So let us discuss the raw material <coughs> of this process. So salt, salt is the raw material first one that is sodium chloride. Next one limestone that is calcium carbonate, cork it is form of carbon, then ammonia, ammonia is act as a catalyst in Solvay process. So the process description step by step, six steps were there. The first, one, first step is preparation and purification of brine, second is ammoniation of brine, third carbon dioxide formation, fourth carbonation of ammonium brine, fifth filtration and calcination, sixth recovery of ammonia. So let us discuss step by step by using a block diagram, okay, by using block diagram and chemical equation also. So the first step, first step is preparation and purification of brine. So preparation of brine means Salt. Salt we are getting from, salt is one of the raw material, that raw material getting from sea water. So this salt contain impurities like uh, calcium magnesium compounds. We have to remove all these impurities and prepare brine. Brine means salt plus water. So that is pure brine. So pure brine. We prepared pure brine. <coughs> okay. So first step over. Second step, ammoniation of brine. So add ammonia to this brine that is ammoniation of brine how will do this kind of okay this ammonium ammonia absorber this is ammonia absorber ammonia coming from bottom bottom ammonia coming from bottom okay and this is coming from the top pure brine coming from the top so counter current contacts after counter current contacts this brine converted into ammonia ammoniacal brine okay now it is sent to filter. So remove all the impurities. Then you got a pure ammoniacal brine. This sent to a carbonating tower. This sent to a carbonating tower. So second step is over. So what is third step? Carbon dioxide formation. Carbon dioxide formation. So carbon dioxide is formed in line clean. The line clean contain calcium carbonate and coke. Okay. So how carbon dioxide is forming? So the chemical reaction I mentioned here. So reaction in line clean. That is first cork plus oxygen. Cork and oxygen combine to produce carbon dioxide. And this process is an exothermic process. Liberate more heat. Using this heat, calcium carbonate will decompose. Then carbon dioxide and calcium oxide will form. This calcium oxide is called cube lime. Okay. So, in line clean, carbon dioxide and calcium oxide will form. This carbon dioxide, this is formation of carbon dioxide, this carbon dioxide sent to carbonating tower. Okay. The carbonating tower consists of four compounds that is water, sodium chloride, ammonia and carbon dioxide. So, how the process is going on here? Then next step is carbonation of ammonium brine. Okay, this is the fourth step. This is the main step in Solvay process. Carbonation of ammonium brine. So this carbonation of ammonium brine takes place in carbonating tower. So how it is going to happen? And the chemical reactions are mentioned here. Reactions in carbonating tower. Ammonia plus water. Ammonia plus water giving ammonium hydroxide. Then carbon dioxide is there. Ammonium hydroxide plus water, uh, the carbon dioxide, ammonium hydroxide plus carbon dioxide giving NH4 twice CO3 plus H2O. This is called ammonium carbonate. 
Then this ammonium carbonate NH4 twice CO3 plus CO2 plus H2O. Again, carbon dioxide and water is adding. Then what you will get? 2NH4HCO3. NH4HCO3. This is ammonium bicarbonate. This ammonium bicarbonate is react added with the, so reacted with the sodium chloride. Sodium chloride is there. So we will get ammonium chloride and sodium bicarbonate. NH4Cl plus NHCO3. This is called sodium bicarbonate. So in carbonating tower, in carbonating tower, one mixture will come that is ammonium chloride and sodium bicarbonate. So what is next step? Next step is filtration and calcination. Okay. This mixture send to a vacuum filter. So the mixture is separated. The one part that is sodium bicarbonate sent to calcination tower. In calcination tower heating process going on. This calcination process so here mention the reaction that is sodium bicarbonate in calcination tower reaction in calcination tower to to nhco3 that is sodium bicarbonate after heating so that is calcination process will get sodium carbonate plus carbon dioxide plus water okay carbon dioxide and water is forming byproducts so this carbon dioxide is sent back to carbonating tower so another part is there that part is ammonium chloride this ammonium chloride is sent to ammonia recovery tank this ammonium chloride is sent to ammonia recovery tank and the last process is sorry last step is recovery of ammonia okay so now the recovery ammonia recovery tank contain ammonium chloride okay so here you know in lime clean calcium oxide is there this calcium oxide is added with the water will produce slack at lime that is calcium hydroxide this calcium hydroxide also sent it to ammonia recovery plants this calcium hydroxide is sent it to ammonia recovery plants so there is some reaction going on that is calcium oxide plus water giving calcium caoh twice that is addition adding water plus calcium oxide then this ammonium chloride this process is takes place in ammonium recovery plant so recovery tower that is nh4cl plus caoh2 is giving nh3 to nh3 plus cacl2 plus 2h2o okay 2h2o so ammonia is producing okay here ammonia is recovered here ammonia is recovered this ammonia is continuously sent to ammonia absorber again okay so this is the process for this is a solvay process and the overall reaction the overall reaction is that calcium carbonate CaCO3 plus 2 NaCl giving Na2CO3 plus CaCl2 okay so remember the six steps then you can easily study this process the first step is purification and that preparation and purification of brine ammoniation of brine then carbon dioxide formation carbon dioxide formation is takes place in lime clean then carbonation of ammonium ammonium brine so that takes place in carbonating tower after that filtration and calcination so in calcination process you will get to the desired product that is sodium carbonate then finally the catalyst ammonia is recovered okay Okay, thank you.